The Appalachian Wireless Holiday Sale is going on now. Till the end of the year, visit us in store or reserve online for an unbelievable sale on the hottest devices. We know what you want for the holidays because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. The Respect for Marriage Act, a landmark bill, passed in the Senate Tuesday, November 29th. The bill ensures protection not only for those in same-sex marriages, but also includes protections for interracial marriages and religious liberty. Well, it just gives us that little bit of extra protection, you know, because everything is so up in the air. You never know what's going to happen the next day. We never thought Roe v. Wade would be overturned, which has provided the backbone for so many other things, not just abortion. That's not what it's all about, and that's never been what it's been about. It's been about control. (laughs) Following the overturning of Roe v. Wade, Supreme Court Justice Clarence Thomas wrote that the court should reconsider Obergefell v. Hodges, amongst other cases. Should Obergefell v. Hodges be overturned, the Respect for Marriage Act ensures states recognize same-sex and interracial marriages performed in states where it is legal. The main reason for our marriage was to protect our rights for if anything was to happen legally. You know, if she was in a car accident or I was in a car accident, that gives her the right to help me, me the right to help her, and not outsiders coming in. And I say outsiders, whether it be family, whether it be friends, whatever, trying to come in and dictate the care for that person. The House must now pass the bill, which could happen as soon as December 6th. The bill will then head to President Biden to become law. For Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.